FSD 12.6.2 was perfect, but let's find out how Tesla FSD, the latest 12.6.3 performs in New York. So let's check it out, guys. I'm gonna engage it and the car is proceeding right away. So I noticed something that in even 12.6.2, I need to press that acceleration to tell the car, please go. But in 12.6.3, I just engage it, the car immediately proceed. Very nice job there. If you're not familiar with me, my name is Inado Mohamed. I love to film Tesla full self-driving videos in New York. We're gonna make a right turn here, but we need to wait here because there are others car coming from our left side. So we need to wait here until there is no other vehicle from our left, we can make that right turn. So let's find out how Tesla FSD handles this situation. Uh, if you watched my yesterday's video, you saw that there was a hesitation while making this right turn and the car was trying to change the lane immediately. And now this time the car didn't even try it because there are other vehicles on our left lane. So hopefully the car will be, you know, performing much better. So I just showed you the release note of the software. So hopefully you got an idea that which software version I'm using and I'm using FSD 12.6.3. This is the latest and greatest for hardware three vehicles. So we are proceeding. As you can see, the car seems very smooth like the previous version 12.6.1 or even 12.6.2. So now there is a school bus, I guess, and we need to stop there. So let's find if our car give a space and nope, it didn't give any space to that truck. I'm extremely sorry. And now, yeah, because there are others car in front of us, so we definitely have to brake, but uh, it would be very interesting if I could see that if there is no vehicle in front of us, if FSD stopped, uh, you know, like for that school bus stop sign. So we're gonna go and proceed. And now our car is proceeding because the school bus started moving, so we can definitely proceed. Uh, I'm from Newark, so that's the law that if there is any school bus on the opposite side, you need to stop if you are even like on the opposite side. So that's the rules. I make a video uh, probably six months ago, people are commenting, hey, you don't need to stop, but this is the Newark law that you need to stop either side. So now we are gonna proceed. This will be a nine minutes drive and the car is doing everything perfectly. The, uh, the weather and the road is kind of uh, wet because it rained earlier. So we're gonna find out how FSD handles this, all of this situation, right guys? It seems like very, you know, like a busy road right now. There are so many cars uh, normally in this road. We don't have that much of traffic but people are going home or in break or something like that. So it is a little, uh, you know, like clutter with cars and stuff like that. So the truck in front of us is going a little slow, definitely. All the other cars are passing by from the left lane. I really don't know when FSD will change the lane and try to go a little fast. It is still following that truck. I'm not very impressed with that because now we turn on the indicator, immediately change the lane and going fast, very good. Probably it just hard it that what I wanna tell to the car, it just hard it and it immediately proceeded perfectly and changed the lane and uh, you know go a little fast and avoid that slow truck in front of us very good job there so uh, we're gonna go straight <laughs> we're still um, seven minutes away from our destination we're gonna find out how FSD handles this last seven minutes the light changed so we need to stop here we need to break behind that white line and uh, yeah, so I'm gonna fast forward that moment where there is nothing happening so that you don't have to sit around and just watch the full clip. Also, I just want to request you, please hit that subscribe button if you're new in this channel. Please, I'm a new content creator. I really need your help, you know? So please hit that subscribe button. So yeah. The light changed and FSD started moving. Very good. Like. 
I'm very impressed like sometimes in previous version the car doesn't want to go like you know like when uh, the light changed so we had to press that acceleration or stuff like that but after FSD 12.6 came in we don't have to do that um, I heard some people are complaining about that in still in this software version but in my my you know like using this software for uh, probably a week or more than that I didn't felt that way so we are proceeding this will be a straight drive there will be a train track and we're gonna hand see how if FSD slows down for the train track and stuff like that there will be red light traffic light there will be like speed changes in the road so we're gonna find out you know like uh, how FSD handles this whole drive um, because I'm trying this in a new road today I uh, normally I always do unprotected left turn narrow road and stuff like that but today there is some time shortage so I have to do a different route Hope you understand right guys also if you're not familiar with me my name is Anato Mohamed and I love to film and you know like show you guys how FSD performs in day-to-day -day basis in New York especially so we are moving as you can see there is that uh, train track I was talking about uh, those car are passing and our car is also passing no it doesn't seems like it slows down for a bit uh, not a problem we are going like 35 so not a big issue but if we're like going like a 45 or even like 50 then you'll feel that bump so I would definitely prefer if uh, we're going a little you know like high speed uh, the car decided to slow down a little bit for train track or stuff like that so we are moving and we are cruising guys um, yeah <clears throat> because of that truck in front of us uh, the car cannot see that traffic light and uh, now we seems like we're stuck behind a slow truck or something like that because all the other cars from our right lane are passing uh, okay so that truck is also passed on the right like also change the lane and move to the right side and now we are here and we have to stop for this stop sign okay slows down nice and smooth very good <clears throat> So how many people are watching right now got this software update FSD 12.6.3 in their Model 3? And if you are watching this content, even you have a AI4 vehicle or hardware 4 vehicle, please comment below. I'm gonna tell you one number. So if you are watching this until now, you know that number and comment below that number that I'm t telling right now. The number is five. <clears throat> so just comment below five or whatever you want for engagement. That'll be a really good help for my channel. So just comment number five or whatever you want to tell me, like any suggestion, any advice, anything or anything you want to see for, for the next video. Just comment below, guys. So we're going, we are cruising like 46 right now. And uh, yeah, we need to stay in this left lane because we're going to make a left turn on that next traffic light, not this one. We're going to pass this traffic light and then we're gonna make a left turn so we're gonna find out how FSD handles right guys so we are going as you can see uh, the light just changed to red to green and uh, yeah we can proceed uh, there is still few traffics here and there as you can see and uh, we are our car just slows down a little bit and uh, hopefully I'm very happy that the car didn't change the lane and move to the right lane and then immediately have to move to the left sometimes in hurry mode the car tries to do that like you know like oh I'm stuck I'm gonna move to move to the right lane and move to the left again so we're gonna go and merge in this left very good I prefer to be change the lane one more time and move to the left lane because uh, I am very hopeful that one day FSD will learn okay there is a truck in front of us and the truck is slow that means if I'm behind the truck I'll be slow or I'll miss that light so I really hope FSD one day will learn okay there is a truck in front of me I'm not gonna go into that lane I'm gonna go into the next lane or something like that I, I hope you understand what I'm trying to say so we are going as you can see we make that left turn perfectly without any problem I still remember in version 10 FSD 10 um, in this exact left turn the car was hesitating so much I still remember those days I used to use FSD version 10 and uh, though at the moment the car was doing so many weird stuff and stuff like that but I'm very happy if you notice that I didn't have to touch my steering wheel once 
not even once like unbelievable i can't even believe that tesla fsd does these things right now and we are not so far from getting unsupervised fsd guys i promise tesla and elon musk and ashok will do it like unsupervised uh, fsd will be amazing because you don't need to do anything you're just gonna sleep in your car and we already almost reached to our destination guys hopefully you enjoy this video and you love this video if you did make sure you hit that subscribe button one more time i'm gonna end the video here you have a wonderful day enjoy your day enjoy your weekend thank you so much i love you and have a wonderful wonderful day